Welcome to Tech World Vlogs on Tesla. If this is the first time we're meeting and you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. I bring all the latest Tesla videos, release, updates, um, and all the latest Tesla products available. And today I've got something special for you guys that I've always contemplated, but finally I uh, decided to pull the trigger and get this product and see what's all about, what's the hype about. This is extremely rare to find. It is out of stock in almost every state in the US and in Canada. The product that I am reviewing today is a Tesla decanter. Uh, this retails in Canada for $190, currently out of stock, and about $150 in the US. This product is actually a mimic of the Tesla Tequila, uh, which was re released back in October of 2021. Um, and it literally took 48 hours to be sold out across North America. So what's special about the decanter is the decanter is a hand-blown, um, hand-crafted, where no, no two bottles look alike, um, glass, I guess, case for liquid. It's unfilled, but it looks exactly like the Tesla Tequila in terms of design, shape, the elegance of it. Um, so I have the box here. Uh, this is what it ships in. This is what it looks like. It has the Tesla logo at the top. And then it has the Tesla um, emblem written right here. It's in a black box. Um, and, and the back of it has made by Earth by humans, which is sort of Tesla. Um, uh, most of Tesla products it has that um, design on it. Uh, so when you open it, this is what it looks like. I'm going to bring the camera closer so you guys can see everything that I see as I open this box. Again, this is the Tesla decanter, um, which is an on-fill bottle that looks exactly like the Tesla Tequila. It's a hand-blown glass, um, and it has all the lightning bolt shape, elegance, design model, form fit factor of the Tesla Tequila. All right, so let's get closer up here as I open this. So when you open it, obviously you have this pattern here. It's glass, so it's easy to break, um, and especially when you're shipping it. So there's this memory foam here and then that's the product right there guys this is the hand-blown glass made by tesla um, in the shape of a lightning bolt and when you actually let's, let's start with the stand so this is the stand this is actually really heavy uh, um this is probably closer to uh, 900 grams in terms of weight it is solid steel does have the tesla emblem there i guess this will tell you that it is the front um and then all over it just simple elegant design and this is where you would use to keep the bottle standing upright so basically a stand probably one of the most fanciest stand i've ever seen so let's put this right here for now and looking deeper into the box we have the actual lightning bolt um, and the story behind the lightning bolt and why it looks like a lightning bolt is electricity. And this is Tesla model of electric uh, future. So it's an electricity shape, shape of a lightning bolt, obviously. And in the front of it, it has the Tesla logo. It says Tesla right there. This is actually made by Tesla. It's authentic, uh, cannot be, uh, I guess, replicated that easily. Um, solid glass. It has that deep gold finish. Um, and what's really really nice about it, it is quite heavy, um, so it's very, it does have some heavy um, structure to it, uh, so it's not like cheap, cheaply made, this is definitely uh, a lot of thought and design went into it, and it is empty, uh, decanter means you can fill it with any of your favorite um, uh, alcohol or favorite whiskey or whatever you want to put it inside, you can fill it with that and then you can use it as storage it goes really nice on your bar so if you have like a like a basement with a nice bar you can actually have this as a display piece in your case um, but yeah this is a way of supporting Tesla as they build the future of electric energy all right that is it in the box there's nothing else um, like I said before this is handcrafted and one of the uh, disclaimer if you go on the Tesla website It'll tell you that no two 
Tesla decanter looks alike. Each one is hand blown glass that is in a shape of its own. So it's actually not like mass produced. That's why it's really hard to find. Uh, so in terms of setting this up, actually let's open it. So when you pop it open, this is a little, um, I guess, hole here for you to pour the liquid out of. And then there's the cap there that actually seals it. And this is a really nice cap, I gotta say. It actually just seals it off so there's no, um, you know, oxidization or any um, leaking of that air that's inside the bottle uh, with this cap. There's really good seal on it. And then it has all the like imperfection of the hand blown glass, which is pretty cool. Actually, once you take the cap off, the bottle is lighter. And once you put it back on, it um, feels much more heavier. All right, so in terms of the stand, you just basically put it like this, and that's how it sits on the desk. Really cool, really interesting design. Um, I'm, I'm not sure what it's like when it's filled, but that's the shape, that's how the load is managed. Uh, it has a little tilt on, I think about 195 tilt, uh, depends on where you put it, but it does provide a lot of storage. So I could see this filling up all the way to the top here, and then probably gives you about, I would say about a liter worth of storage inside. Um, but yeah, this is the Tesla decanter. Um, what do you guys think? Okay. Is it overpriced? Is it overkill? Every once in a while, Tesla comes out with these weird random product that um, Elon Musk probably think of. Um, and this might this might actually be the weirdest. Not sure since when Tesla start producing decanters. Um, but yeah, every once in a while, Tesla produce these weird product and I want to get my hands on it. One of the other product I'm waiting to arrive in Canada is the Tesla Whistle, which is made out of the same Cybertruck uh, material that um, the Cybertruck is made out of. So I'm waiting to get my hands on that to review it, uh, to see why uh, someone paid that amount of money for it. Uh, but yeah, like I said, this is pretty cool. Might be practical in some home if you are really loyal to Tesla brand. Uh, I can see why someone would spend that money to get this here, put it in the bar, a nice iconic uh, piece. Uh, but yeah, that's my uh, take on it. Uh, like I said, I like to get my hands on these things to review it and bring it to you guys. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel and also hit the like button, share this video on Facebook, on Instagram, on Twitter, wherever you share your videos and stay connected, stay safe. And we'll see you on the next video.